वेलकम टू माई चैनल आई होप यू ऑल हैव सीन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो वेर आई एक्सप्लेन टू यू हाउ टू ड्रॉ ग्रिड लाइन्स फॉर एनी परफेक्ट डॉट पेंटिंग If you haven't seen that yet then please do check that later the link will be given in the description below In today's video you will get to know what alternative you can use in place of black canvas for your dot paintings and if you stay till the end then you will be fortunate enough to view a simple yet elegant dot painting design We all know that black canvases like these are an ideal choice for any dot mandala paintings. I have used these for my commissioned work and also for my workshops. But if you are a beginner or kids trying out new techniques or you are an art teacher and wants to take workshops for kids then this alternative is going to be very helpful. as it is budget friendly and easily available many a times we don't try out new things as the cost attached to it comes first in our mind and we step back but believe me this alternative is definitely going to be a budget friendly option as i mentioned earlier from the clippings you all might have already guessed what's that yeah It's nothing too fancy. It's our normal black chart paper. Yes, it's the same that our kids use for their school activities, but do try to get a thicker version of it. You get a whole big chart paper in just 15-20 rupees. Isn't that budget friendly? Cut them in different sizes of your choice and start trying out new designs. There are many channels dedicated to dot painting. You can practice from those channels or if you want you can try out my the simple design. Are you going to be with me? Then what are you waiting for? Let's start. Here I have already drawn the grid lines by using a normal HB pencil. It will be a little difficult to see but the advantage is that you will not have to erase the extra visible grid lines at the end. In place of HB pencil you can also use white charcoal pencil to improve the visibility. I'm using my paint brushes of different sizes as my dotting tools. In one of my previous video I have shown few alternatives to use in place of dotting tools which again are pocket friendly. Do check out that video too. Okay, so let's get back to our painting. Dip straight in and lift off. Don't dip it too much and also see that You hold your dotting tool straight down and not slanting. Add dots according to your design. I have added dots on the intersection of angle lines and concentric circles. Keep adding the dots according to your wish or pattern that you want to follow. Along with dots you can add few other designs. I will show you one design that I recently tried and will definitely recommend you to try. First apply dots and then drag that paint like this. Let me show you one more time. Try
try out few variations of it. Dot painting is like a meditation. It relaxes you and makes you calm. You get engrossed in the patterns and get into focused creation. It requires a lot of patience and attention to detail, but at the end it gives the satisfaction of deep focused work. For my satisfaction and passion, I like to paint wild animals and birds. For students of my classes, I work on fruits, flowers and landscapes using color pencils and oil pastels. But for my relaxation, I like to paint dot mandala paintings. Let me know what would you like to paint? when you want to relax and calm your mind i would love to know that hope this video was helpful to you If you haven't subscribed yet or if you are new to my channel do consider subscribing it and also don't forget to hit that bell button so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos Thanks for taking out time and staying with me till the end See you in the next video till then take care bye bye Sorry I forgot to tell you if you enjoyed this video which i am guessing you did since you stayed all the way till the end please be sure to give a big thumbs up it really helps my small channel to grow bye